Hi, this is Eric from Guitar Zone, Guitar Hut 11 videos. I'm demonstrating the Space Bender pedal by Death by Audio. I've noticed a lot of people using it, but not exactly how I use it, so I made a little loop. I'm going to just improvise some stuff over it. And then I love to discuss my pros and cons and, uh, you know, some, uh, you know, my thoughts. So uh, stay tuned. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed the demonstration. Uh, it could have been better probably, but I was literally making it up on the spot, and that is the truth. You better believe me on that. That was <clears throat> that was all made up, <laughs> but it really was. Uh, but yeah, so the, the the space bender. It's a very interesting pedal. It's functionally, as I understand, very fast delays um, that can be modulated uh, in such a way that creates a chorus, a flanger, modulated delay, a comb filter, and almost weird resonator-like sounds. It's very fun to use. Um, maybe run through some very brief settings I used here or something. I've never made a video before. This is what my guitar is. Very clean. Almost too clean. <laughs> Turning it on, though. It's very weird. <laughs> I mean, like, that was... That's really the most extreme setting you could do. But uh, turning it to um, the LFO mode, turning it on low here, and we're on 1x. As you could hear, it's sort of an interesting chorus, uh, almost, or flanger, I don't know what you'd say. Um... Putting it over here, it's almost like, uh... Very bizarre spring reverb. Putting it in times ten, it slows the delays by ten times. And then it gives you just a delay pedal, essentially. You can 
get pretty slow. The envelope mode controls uh, the pitch or something. I don't even know how it works. Turn the depth all the way. It really gets wacky. Slow. I mean, it's super fast. It gets weird on high. Probably use that for something. But to me, see where this pedal shines in general, is with some distortion or overdrive. I'm using the Falcon by Crazy Tube Circuits. To get quite a weird, uncanny valley pitch effect comb filter thing. stuff up really what i wanted to say is it's a cool pedal i uh wish it had uh from what you probably saw in my little improvisation i wish it had some sort of um expression pedal control or something like that because where it really shines in my opinion is doing uh crazy pitch effects modulate you know turning the knobs and stuff while you're playing turn on my uh Buzz factory here. And as you can see, that sounds pretty wild in my opinion. Hopefully yours too. <laughs> I mean, you know. Yeah, so, uh, the problem is it's hard to turn the knobs. I'm using my trusty uh, sock with a hole in it, but you know on stage is probably pretty hard so I feel like it would be nice similar to the um, you know many just delay pedals where you can uh, adjust the whatever uh, variable or whatever the you know you know what I'm talking about with the pedal uh, along with that I wish it did have I think some sort of blend function on the uh, particularly on the uh, times 10 mode where it's more of a delay sometimes you don't want that much delay <laughs> I feel like notes can get lost in there You know, it's meant to be an extreme pill, so what are you going to do? Um, beyond that, that's all I have to say. Thank you. Please ring my bells. And uh, if you could subscribe on my bell, that would be amazing. I'm going to try to keep making video and show you how I do the pedals. So thank you. Bye. <laughs>